हेलो एवरीवन आई एम आशीष शौर्य असिस्टेंट प्रोफेसर इन कंप्यूटर साइंस एंड इंजीनियरिंग डिपार्टमेंट सागर इंस्टीट्यूट ऑफ रिसर्च एंड टेक्नोलॉजी भोपाल एंड दिस इज माय फोर्थ वीडियो लेक्चर ऑन कंप्यूटर नेटवर्क एंड टूडेज टॉपिक इज कनेक्शन ओरिएंटेड एंड कनेक्शन लेस सर्विसेज ओके सो लेट्स स्टार्ट इन टू दिस वीडियो वी कवर कनेक्शन ओरिएंटेड सर्विसेज कनेक्शन लेस सर्विसेज कनेक्शन ओरिएंटेड वर्सेज कनेक्शन लेस सर्विसेज ओके सो कनेक्शन ओरिएंटेड एंड कनेक्शन लेस सर्विसेज मीन्स वॉट डेटा कम्युनिकेशन इज अ टेलीकम्युनिकेशन नेटवर्क टू सेंड and receive data between two or more computers over the same or different network there are two ways to establish a connection before sending data from one device to another that are connection oriented and connection less services connection connection oriented service involves the creation and termination of the connection for sending the data between two or more devices in contrast connection less services does not require establishing any connection and termination process for the transferring the data over the network a connection oriented service is a network service that was designed and developed after the telephone system a connection oriented service is used to create an end to end connection between the sender and the receiver before transmitting the data over the same or different networks in connection oriented services packets and transmitted packets are transmitted to the receiver in the same order and the sender has sent them it uses a handshake method that creates a connection between the user and the sender for transmitting the data over the network hence it is also known as reliable network service suppose a sender want to send data to the receiver then first the sender sends a request packet to the receiver in the form of syn packet after that the receiver responds to the sender request with an acknowledgement single signals and packets that represents the confirmation is received by the receiver to start the communication between the sender and the receiver now a sender can send the message or data to the receiver similarly a receiver can respond or send the data to the sender in the form of packets after successfully exchanging or transmitting data a sender can transmit the connection by sending a signal to the receiver in this way we can say that it is a reliable network service in the reliable network service there is a one protocol that is tcp what is tcp tcp means the full form of the tcp is transmission control protocol and it means is a connection oriented protocol that allow communication between two or more computer devices by establishing connections in the same or different network it is the most important protocol that uses internet protocol to transfer the data from one end to the another hence it is sometimes referred to as tcpip it ensure that 
the connection is established and maintained until the data packets is transferring between the sender and receiver is complete now we talk about the connection less services so a connection is similar to a postal system in which each letter takes along different routes paths from the source to the destination address connection less service is used in the network system to transfer data from one end to another end without creating any connection so it does not require establishing a connection before sending the data from the sender to the receiver it is not a reliable network service because it does not guarantee the transfer of data packets to the receiver and data packets can be received in any order to the receiver therefore we can say that the data packet does not follow a defined path in connectionless service the transmitted data packet is not received by the receiver due to network congestion and data may be lost in that condition for example a sender can directly send any data to the receiver without establishing any connection because it is a connectionless service data sent by the sender will be in the packet or data streams containing the receiver's address in connectionless service the data can be traveled and received in any order however it does not guarantee to transfer of the packet to the right destination for the connectionless service we use udp protocol udp means user datagram protocol is a connectionless protocol that allow communication between two or more devices without establishing any connection in this protocol a sender send the data packets to the receiver that holds the destination address a udp does not ensure to deliver the data packet to the correct destination and it does not generate any acknowledgement about the sender's data similarly it does not acknowledge the receivers about the data hence it is an unreliable protocol okay so thank you thank you everyone